Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, my name is Nena Obasi and this is my first YouTube video. So I am from Nigeria and I'm from a boarding state precisely in Nigeria. I'm currently doing my masters in the UK and I enjoy singing. I laugh a lot for some reasons. <laughs> so I decided to do um, a get to know me video alongside my welcome video. So I got some people to ask me some questions of which I am going to be asking myself right now. So let's get right into the video. First of all, I these questions I'm about to ask have not been pre-answered. I will try as much as possible to answer these questions as natural as possible. So um what inspired you to start a YouTube channel? Um what inspired me to start a YouTube channel was because I've been watching like lots of YouTube videos, especially from this lady, Total Lopez Solutions. I don't know if you know her. And I really enjoy what she does. I like the fact that she's able to touch lives like through her YouTube channel. Like I really enjoy her channel and I would say, I can say she is part of the reason I decided to start up a YouTube channel. Then the second aspect is it, what inspires you? What inspired you? Well, I don't know. I just really felt the need to start a YouTube channel, especially during quarantine, instead of staying at home and doing nothing and just pull my thoughts out there and just like be able to just talk <laughs> and express myself for the world to see, basically that. So, um, what is your channel going to be about? The channel is going to be about anything and everything as it comes to me like i'll be doing vlogs giving advices be doing games pranks mukbangs and all of them story times and the rest of them so as it comes to me i'll try as much as possible to keep posting videos just stay tuned <laughs> so the next question is Three things. What are the three things we should know about you? Hmm. Not to be proud or anything. No. <laughs> I'm a very nice person. Like I'm actually really nice. Number one, number two. Um. This is okay. I'm really nice. But then, if you just meet me for the first time, I I give this vibe that you probably would not like. I just. I don't know until you get to know me that's when you would see how nice i can be but if you don't know me you might think i'm like a bad person or something or i'm like a snob so but i'm actually really nice number two i'm very very emotional like i i wonder sometimes like i actually wonder like you know how can you be this emotional like i wonder i'm too emotional and number three hmm which other thing should I know about myself? <laughs> I detach easily, like I don't like when people are too clingy to me, especially when you mean nothing to me. Like if we are cool, like I really like you and we are down, like if, if we are cool, I don't even mind being clingy. I can't even be clingy myself, but like not too clingy though, but like you get what I'm saying. When people are too clingy it pisses me off and then i don't know i tend to detach really easily like i tend to detach easily for some reason except you are very very important to me i just tend to, to detach really easily next question um <laughs> are you single or you are taken are you single or you are taken hmm, funny question well i am single I do not have a boyfriend okay so next question says what is your idea of a dream date <laughs> um my idea of a dream date well 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 
Um, I don't really fancy going to expensive places and spending a lot of money and all that. Like, obviously, who wouldn't like it? I do. But then, what would be my idea of a dream date is doing something that would make us be able to spend like quality time together and may involve walking, taking a walk down the street, maybe watching a movie together in the house, something that can that we can talk. And just have like quality time, quality time actually. Then the next question says, What is your pet peeve? Oh my god, I despise it when people chew out loudly. I hate it, like, I hate it, I hate it, like, I hate it so much. Why do you have to chew out loudly? Like, can't you chew properly? Like, why? Just, just say, I'm doing. Can't you chew your mouth closed? Like, I do not get it. <sighs> That's by the way. And I hate when people snore. God, if you are snoring beside me, I will slap you. Like, I will literally slap you. I will slap you because why are you snoring? Okay, the things that the trick then for I learned from my secondary school was that if you are snoring and they slap you, like, if they slap you and run away, <laughs> and you wake up and you look around, <laughs> you will not see anybody. But for that period, like that you woke up and you're about to go back to sleep it would have been a period of silence do you understand so we'll slap you like i would literally slap you if you're if you're snoring beside me so i'm like my pet peeve next question says how would you describe your fashion sense <laughs> now this question is funny because i wouldn't say I'm a very very fashionable person like obviously I want to be a fashionable person but my fashion is not bad don't get me wrong it's not bad it's just normal it's just there I don't look bad but I don't wear like extreme clothing and all you get so I'll just say my fashion sense is normal let me just put it that way it's not it's not bad because I actually look good when I want to look good but, oh yeah so next question says um, what is your favorite style of music? Um, I love R&B music. Um, I really love slow music for some reasons, for some weird reasons. Whether Christian music or secular music, it has to be slow. I don't even know. I hate all these bing, 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 bing. <sighs> songs. Like, I just sometimes it can be depressing though. I don't know why I listen to the songs. Like, I wonder sometimes. I actually wonder like i ask myself like why i just move on from this but then i do man. i can't help it and the second aspect of the questions i see is what is your favorite style and type of movie i do not like horror movies i do not like i'm not a, like i'm not really a fan of action either i love it but like i'd rather choose rom-com over action anytime any day i don't know i'm just saying Lovey dovey person for some weird reason. Very mushy. <laughs> I can be very mushy at times. So, like, I, I would say wrong come. So, the next question Do you have any bad habits? Hmm. Yes, yeah, so I do. I do. <laughs> I do actually. So, I'm easily irritated. Like, I am very irritated. Like, I get irritated by a lot of things. But if that was just it, that would, that would, then maybe it won't be counted as a bad habit. But then I have this habit of not knowing how to hide my expressions. Now I think about it, I don't know if it's just a habit. Can you describe it as? But like regardless, like I cannot hide my facial expressions once I'm disgusted by anything. Like if I'm happy, you would know. If I am sad, you would know. Like. I can't hide my expressions for whatsoever, like whatever reason. I am so like I'm so irritated by everything. It's so annoying <laughs> to people around me. My grandma complains. I'm always like ah, 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 all the time. I'm like I don't do like this now. <laughs> she said like it's just bad. Like some people have told me that my facial expressions are bad. I I need to work on it. But then I just can't help it. Like so guys we've come to the end of this video i hope you enjoyed it um please do not forget to share to like and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next video bye, -bye. <laughs>
I'm on the sideline